Eric Moore with Mother.com. Let's take a look at the chart for Bitcoin and we are using the Bitfinex exchange. We can see here that we've touched the 18,000 price level, making a new intraday all time high on the back of what has been a dream 2017 move. Now I want to show you some of the breakout levels that we are seeing so we can use them as reference points. By the way, this is going to be the third in a series of video. Uh, the first one is right here and I'll, I'll have them in the description of the video. And then there's a follow up video which is right here. This is going to be the third in this series. So take a look at those two videos if you want to understand how this has played out over the last couple of days. So this conclusion here is inescapable. It's very simple here. We see that the most recent closing high as far as the Bitcoin is trading on the Bitfinex exchange, we can see that as long as it is breaking out above 16,000, 972, this is a breakout. Now we've had more than two, two days of rest, which is the minimum requirement. So this is a good breakout as long as we can sustain price levels above 16,972, we might actually be looking to stream high. Now I'm going to have the other breakout levels for the other exchanges, like for example, Coinbase, also on the Bitstamp and also on the Kraken exchange. I'm going to have the precise breakout levels here. I'm only using Bitcoin by way of the Bitfinex exchange so we can save time. And again, as long as we are breaking out on the daily after a good two day rest period, and I'll have links about all these things I'm talking about in the description of the video. So anything above 16,972 is a quality, quality breakout. In other words, bulls should be very excited with this move. And because we know that the level is well defined, bears would like this breakout to fail. Once this breakout fails, after such a huge move, don't be surprised to, to see a big, big reversal. Now, what could cause this to stall? Let me show you the hourly chart. And let's begin with the lows here before the recent surge. And we can see that is consistent with this breakout here. Once we break out above this level in price, we don't look back in terms of the reaction in price. This entry here corresponds with this RSI movement. So we take that level and draw our support line. And you can see that Bitcoin did come back and test this line multiple occasions during the lows here, here and here before the recovery. And also we can see that once it moved above a certain range, which also happens to be the previous negative divergence line. So once we move above this level, we can see that there was a reaction by the cryptocurrency moving higher, which this breakout here corresponds with that movement. Now I want to show you what could be happening in terms of the current situation. And it creates a challenging spot for Bitcoin. If we take the previous break, there's a line somewhere there. The daily breakout needs to hold. As long as the daily breakout is holding, then the bulls are in control. This should see much, much higher prices. And we know that if this breakout fails, then that's going to be a signal, a very strong signal that the market has run out of energy and is about to correct severely. So on the Bitfinex exchange, it needs to hold above 16,000. 972 if this breakout is to continue adding on to the current all-time high status let's also not forget that as long as the daily is showing strength by the rsi holding above 69.1 as we are seeing right here as long as the rsi is holding above 69.1 on the daily this market remains very very strong same thing can be said on the weekly as long as the weekly RSI continues to hold above 69.1, this market continues to be sideways to very, very bullish. And of course, we know that the monthly continues to hold above 
something it has done since right here towards the end of 2016 where the monthly RSI jumped above 69.1 monthly RSI held above 69.1 here and of course the more we stay above this RSI level the more we can expect an expansion of this current hyperbolic move but the best way to actually look at this to simplify this is go back to the daily and make sure that the daily is breaking out as long as the daily is breaking out successfully then there's all the reason in the world to chase the current momentum if the daily breakout fails then that's going to be a sign that one can even consider taking the bearish side which is to short expecting a huge pullback given the nature of the big run that is seen on the monthly at some point there's going to be a huge huge pullback because of the substantial move that the cryptocurrency has seen over the last couple of months so this hyperbolic move at some point when it cracks is going to actually give us the exact opposite which is a huge huge mega sell-off mega reversal but watch the daily breakout because short term that's the key a successful daily breakout means we continue chugging along to the upside and a failed daily breakout is gonna spook momentum traders which is gonna spill over and cause a stampede for the exits eric mother mother.com as always good luck peace and blessings e a c s Mwah. Woo.